When was the last time we and our kids had fun get together with the neighbors? When was the last time we played good old board games with kids? Do the Gen Next kids even play board games anymore? When was the last time kids did anything creative purely for the pleasure of it and not as an assignment? When was the last time we took our kids on a nature walk without fretting about the calories to burn? Most of us may have to think for a real long time to recount any such wonderful exhilarating experiences as we are all caught up in the hustle bustle of everyday lives. An average middle school child has a chalk A block schedule similar to a corporate CEO's. School classes, special classes, tuition classes, IIT Zenit coaching classes, probably PG and PhD preparation classes too. With all work, no play, and so much pressure from parents, teachers, peers and neighbors, the tender kids are akin to a pressure cooker. Kids can realize their full potential only when they break free from the clutter of monotony. Stress-free outlets of expression will go a long way in shaping healthy, secure, creative, competitive minds. Play is a natural innate way of expression not just for humans but also animals, to bring out the spark from within. Play is not just for fun but it inculcates vital life lessons without being preachy. A combination of physical play and expressive play is essential not only for kids but also grown-ups to develop a creative, strategic, holistic approach in life. PlayPal is an amazing platform bringing As all this to the As a child I have explored the magical sights, sounds and smells of the fresh blooms, ripe and unripe fruits, just drenched soil, rustling leaves, nesting birds, soothing breeze. This made me a tailless ball of energy climbing trees, scaling walls, shaking branches to collect mangoes, raw tamarind, jujubes, wild berries. Just watching a golden bug trot gave a golden glow to my face at the golden sunset hour. Play Pal's nature walk made me relieve these golden moments as the kids and I began to march into the groove singing ants go marching one by one giving competition to the cuckoos chirping. In the midst of nature's warm embrace, mindfulness was the theme. All the untapped senses came alive finding a renewed spirit. Algebra, fractions, periodic table, acid spaces, digestive system, respiratory system, Mughal Empire, British rule, war dates. All these terms send shivers down not just school kids but also parents. But whoever thought that all of these and many more complicated confusing topics could be so much fun by associating with games. The middle school students had such a pleasant surprise as they played the fraction bump game, cell taboo, ecology game, algetropolis, organ system game, samrat. This perked their interests towards dreaded subjects and also improved speed, alacrity, problem-solving skills, coordination, and team spirit. Kids who walked in as stranger, after the icebreakers and workshop, went out as buddies and friends. Thus proving the saying play is our brain's favorite way of learning.
play date got toddlers to teens to adults to senior citizens together in a relaxed setting to play board games like Brain Vita, Monopoly, Yenga, Dartboard. The grey-haired wise folks became jolly good sports as they played with the unstoppable kids. It's went home a little wiser and adults unleashed the child within. There is an unknown artist in each of us. Getting to a serene locale, either a park or groove or the beach or the sunset view could inspire unbound creative freedom. Lost aspirations and dreams will find wings of expression. Exactly this is what happened as we took the kids on a creative task in the midst of nature. There were no rules or regulations. The children used anything they could find like petals, pebbles, leaves, stones, pattern seeds to make unique masterpieces, t. His is an extension of their own identity as a resourceful creator. This gave unbridled joy that the children vowed to do this every week. These five weeks of playful activities unleashed the joy of creativity and free expression amongst the kids and the facilitators alike. 